I've been talking to you about loss. Now I want to talk to a specific group of people who have experienced loss. Now this is for you if you're the type of person who never says die. Okay, you're going to fight to the bitter end. You're the type of person he keep, who keeps going even if you're sick, even if you've got the flu, you're out here working, you're out trying to do something. Yeah, you may rest on occasion. You know, you're smart enough to know you need to do that. But overall, you're not a quitter. You're someone who sticks it out and fights and does whatever you can do. You're probably also someone who wants to make the world a better place and if you're going through something difficult you're already thinking about how you can help other people with whatever you learn along the path of this hard thing you're going through okay and you're just determined you have to find a way to get through it so that not only can it help you but it can help other people too okay if this is you I'm talking to you if you've gone through something really hard really difficult you've suffered a lot of loss and you've really felt like you've been smashed down and here's the analogy I use there's there's so many points along the path where I felt like somebody's slamming to the ground face first in the dust they got a boot in my back they've got my hands tied behind my back and they're screaming create Marnie create <laughs> you know make something fix this and you feel that urgency that you have to fix this okay if you're feeling that I want to tell you something God is not telling you to stick it out a little longer or fight a little harder or endure to the end or whatever. That's not what this is about. You got that covered. You are a fighter. You are determined. You will not quit. That is not what God is trying to teach you. I want you to take that off the plate. It's not that you need to work harder or hang on tighter or whatever. That's not it. Tell you what he's teaching you. Let go. He's trying to teach you you don't control the outcome. He's trying to teach you to let go and let him be in charge. And just let it be. Let it be what it is. Embrace it. Radical acceptance of the way things are. And that it you might not be able to figure this out. You might not be able to fix this. And it's got to be okay. It's that submitting as a little child. To whatever the Father sees fit to inflict upon us. That is what he's trying to teach you. How to let go. Now to tell you how to do that, <laughs> I think that's a personal experience. I don't know that I can tell you how to do that. There's different things that I've used. Uh, energy tools, meditations, different things that I can kind of uh, share with you that will help you get there. But the realization, that point of knowing when to let go and how to do it for you, it's a personal journey. And I hope you find it. <laughs> I hope you find it soon, if you haven't already.